Hey guys, uh, welcome to another unboxing. Today we are checking out the Interceptor Tactical Footwear. This is from Walmart, uh, featuring Enduro Pro Anti Fatigue Footbed. All right, durable waterproof upper leather, slip and oil resistant outsole, polishable toe, comfortable, generous fit, white KK zipper for durable, easy on off. Okay, so. Not only is this unboxing, this is also a review of this boot because um, I'm ordering, I got a new pair, not just, um, well, because the toe was getting worn out a little bit. Yeah, that's like the only thing that was wearing out on this. And uh, not really the boot's fault, it's just kind of I was hooking my foot under things and uh, doing stuff and getting ripping the leather there or whatever um, so I've had these I think about a year or so that's it, like the only issue these are super easy to get on and off you just lace up your boots the way you want it and with this nice zipper here super great idea usually normal boots it's gonna take you you know a couple minutes to lace them up and all that this is literally faster than my tennis shoes all right so I work 16 hour days on concrete I'm on my feet 99% of the time these are the most comfortable footwear I've ever had I've worn Nike Air Monarchs uh, Skechers uh, other shoes with extra insoles my feet would be sometimes burning at the end of the day not with these I mean I'm literally running around on concrete pretty much for 16 hours straight and no foot problems at all. Um, I highly recommend these shoes. Um, I don't get paid to say this. I'm literally, this is the most comfortable uh, of any kind of footwear. I'm not just talking boots of any kind of footwear I've ever worn for that a period of time. And my foot hasn't been hurting or sore or burning or anything like that. So... Yeah, that's why I got a second pair, and they're only like 40 bucks too, so, I mean, they've come a long way. I bought some boots at Walmart before, and I wore them, and my shoes, or my feet, were literally, literally on fire. I mean, it was like painful. So, I believe, you know what? Why does this look like a different boot? Okay, so maybe this is the upgraded version. Definitely the uh, top is taller. These are ten and a halfs, right? I hope I got the same one. Okay, so ten and a half. Yep, ten and a half. These are interceptors. Maybe they just changed the... Uh... These look like longer. They are longer, so... Well, that's all good. Just uh, not the same ones that I had. Just a higher top, I guess. I didn't check that too well. But I'm um, hoping these are going to be just as comfortable as those other ones. So let's try it on because I love these boots. They're now my uh, <coughs> weed eater boots. But they're good for that too because they got a longer thing. So if the you got your pant leg comes over this, you're not going to get um, grass and everything. Ooh, excuse me, burp them in your shoes. So, love, love, love these. Um, yeah. So, I'm going to try this one on. I'm really hoping that they're as comfy as those other ones. That's another thing. Metal eyelets. Um, super uh, good to have, too, so they don't rip your boot. Uh, let's get this thing on here, shall we? All right. So... Kind of lace them up. I noticed a couple things. This must be their new. Maybe this is. They have a couple different versions of like a uh, higher top one or whatever. But a um, couple things. So the spread on this, as far as like um, widening out to get your foot on, is not nearly as much as this one is. So you notice that the old one, it's probably almost twice as much. A lot easier to get my foot in and out. So, have this one here. Just slip my foot in really, really easy. Look at this, uh, probably 
a lot of there's a lot of extra room there almost twice as much as that so and this one's higher so it feels just as comfortable but when, when I lace it up it's kind of hard to get my foot out and I'm a little disappointed in that and that might not be I don't know why they would loose make this um, shorter but if they're as comfortable as the last ones were for as long as they were so it's a snug fit but I think <laughs> good golly maybe need a shoehorn or something to get it in there so can man if I had a handle here in the back it'd be good too if I could just grip that okay so it needs to be worked in a little bit also but um there we go um feels super comfortable good ankle support this is waterproof as well obviously not as broken in as those other boots i had so but if they're if they're the same as far as comfort as these things um yeah i love these boots so um that's kind of the review there guys and that's uh, what I don't know how long I've had these, about a year I'd say. Really no wear so much at the bottom. Everything else, no, none of the loopholes broke or anything. Super comfy, you know, just the leather on the, the part, on the toe just kind of fraying. So that's the only reason. Switch over these, let's make them some good weed eating boots, good to go. Get some new ones, they're not like Danners or anything, we're like 300 bucks. Um, but really, really, comfortable boots um can't really stress that enough as far as just overall footwear so this doesn't have a steel toe but it's a little reinforced more than your rival <coughs> excuse me average um boot toe or average you know tennis shoe toe so um if these are they already feel pretty comfy so if they're half as good as the other ones i'll love these boots Thought I'd share this with you guys. Thanks for watching. Have a wonderful day. We'll catch you next time.